Welcome to the Today in History channel. In today's video we will talk about the day, May 15, 1989, withdrawal of Soviet troops from Afghanistan. The process that led to the dramatic situation in Afghanistan began with the military coup that, in 1978, brought to power a group of young leftist officers who established a communist regime under Nur Muhammad Taraki. The socializing and secular reforms that the new government tried to promote met enormous resistance in the population, clinging to an Islamism anchored in the past, and that lived in a society still feudal. The resistance soon organized itself into Islamist Mujahideen guerrillas, until the internal conflicts of the two main communist tendencies precipitated the intervention of the Soviet Union which invaded the country in 1979. This intervention provoked an immediate American reaction. Washington considered Afghanistan to be outside the Soviet area of influence, so it began an aggressive strategy in response to the invasion. It initiated an embargo on the grain that was going to be exported to the USSR and began to send military aid to the Islamic guerrillas. The war ended quickly, and while the more than 100,000 Soviet soldiers controlled the cities, guerrillas dominated rural areas. The conflict caused a massive displacement of the population, so that, in 1982, almost 3 million Afghans had fled to Pakistan, and 1.5 million to Iran. The guerrillas, trained and heavily armed by the United States, and reinforced with volunteers Arabs and Muslims imbued with a radical Islamic ideology, among them Saudi Osama bin Laden kept an increasingly demoralized Soviet army in check. Finally, during perestroika, Gorbachev decided to withdraw his troops from what many called Soviet Vietnam. In 1988, the Soviet Union, the United States, Pakistan, and Afghanistan signed an agreement by which the Soviets pledged to withdraw their troops as soon as possible, which they did in 1989. However, this did not bring peace to the country, since in 1992, Islamic guerrillas assaulted Kabul, and a period of intestinal strife began which culminated in Islamic Taliban extremists taking power in 1996. Did you like the video? In the description you will find the blog link with the full article. Give an incentive by subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting and sharing with your friends. Hugs. Until the next.